Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another video review. I am the Tech Gooch, and I've got a nice little pro uh, portable uh, item for you for review. Uh, and this is by Billy Fun, uh, B I L I F U N. I will put a link directly to this uh, on their Amazon site or uh, product right at the top of the description. So check that out. If you do purchase through that link, thank you for supporting the show. But that's it. Uh, so these guys actually sent this over to me to check out. Um, it is a mini portable Bluetooth shower speaker. So it's got a big old suction cup on the back, and you literally stick this stick this right to the edge of your shower, whether it's tile or uh, tub surround, whatever it has. As long as it has something that is glossy finish that you can actually stick a suction cup to, this will stick to it. Glass door, whichever. Um, at first, when I saw it, I didn't know how much power it would have. Uh, it's pretty simple. They give you a USB cable to charge it. They don't give you an AC adapter. They just give you a USB cable. But... Uh, most people have something for their phones or whatever. And obviously, if you have a Bluetooth speaker, you probably have a smartphone. So, um, but uh, micro USB to charge it. There is an auxiliary input as well. So you can play from auxiliary devices. But of course, they give you a little rubber cover so you can cover that up. Because, well, you're going to be using it in the shower, right? That's kind of the reason that you would purchase probably uh, a mini Bluetooth shower speaker. is probably because you want to play, play it in the shower. So, um, that said... Uh, pretty, pretty simple, pretty awesome. Um, simple layout, like most Bluetooth speakers. Play, pause, uh, call, which is basically answer and hang up phone calls. Power button in the middle, and then volume up, volume down, or next track, previous track. Uh, so first, I'm gonna, I've already paired it with my phone. So if I push and hold the pl the power button, okay. So that's just gonna tell you that I'm gonna stick it to the table here. Uh, to tell you that it's obviously powering up. And you can see that there's a maybe I shouldn't do that. There's a little blue light that's kind of blinking there. And now it's told me that it just actually connected to my phone. So it is connected and ready to go. Um, I'm not even gonna touch my phone. Uh, I should have some songs. Yeah, okay. So I'm just gonna hit the play pause button. It'll actually start playing. But to be honest, the one thing about this Bluetooth speaker, it sounds better if you have it against a uh, something that's actually gonna come out because the speakers are on the back side. Uh, so that when you put it against something hard, it's going to bounce back, right? And it'll actually flood out around all sides of it rather than uh, directional speakers. So it actually sounds better if you have to actually have it stuck to something. Um, right, okay. oh, yeah. oh, I know. So if I... If I Hit the plus or minus button, just tap that, so push the button. It's gonna go previous track or next track, right? Minus is previous, plus is next, right? Pretty obvious. If I push and hold it though, it's gonna actually adjust the volume. So let me go back in here. So I'll push and hold that minus. And it'll bring the volume down. Um, same thing with plus. Obviously, I'm gonna push and hold. Obvious that it's pretty loud, right? Um, and especially at the bounce back. Now, when you're in a shower, I have not put it at max volume yet because in a shower you get a lot of equiness to it, so you don't need as much volume as you would think. Because obviously, when I'm in the shower, the water is fairly loud itself. I have the bath the bathroom fan, on, which is pretty loud as well. Um, but to be honest, with the speaker bouncing off of the tile, at least I have tile in my bathroom. Uh, I get a lot of a lot of volume out of it. Uh, of course, at the same time that I also don't want to make it too loud, so that my people watching TV in the other room are going, "What the heck?" Or if I'm waking up my kids, right? Uh, so I've actually listened to audiobooks. I've listened to music and everything. You can take the suction cup off. So if you have the suction cup on the wall, uh, and you you do not have to take the whole thing off. If you just want to take the speaker off. Um, I will say that if you don't have the suction or if the walls wet. It, it'll slide um, but if uh, if you have good contact you can actually push and hold on this while you you take it off um, but just keep in mind that guy there that you can actually take the the suction cup off uh, and then again if I push and hold the power button just told me that it turned off so pretty awesome pretty basic uh, it works very very well um, you know it I don't think that you're gonna want to submerge this but it is going to be resistant to the point where you can take a shower with it, right? Uh, you're just not going to want it to go in the bathtub with it filled with water. So, pretty awesome. Um, for the money, 16 bucks, I think it would have cost. 
uh, not bad. So definitely check it out. Check it out on uh, the link. Like uh, I'll post at the top of the description, like I said before. Um, and let me know what you think. There's a comment section below this video for a reason. And you can post a comment and let me know what you think or if you have any questions on it. Uh, same thing goes with the subscribe and the like button. They're there for you to use. And I would love for you to like the video as well as subscribe to my channel so you get updates on my next videos. Um, let other people know. Share this. Obviously, that's what social media is for. So check us over on Facebook and everything at TechGooch. Check us over at thetechgooch.com. Pretty awesome little product. And it's usable. And I like usable products. That's my kind of thing. So if you have anything uh, else for me or if you have any products that you would like to have featured on my channel, let me know. Otherwise, we will catch you on the next review. Thanks for coming, guys.